So what's your advice? My name is Greg, you're watching How to Play Paintball. Okay, so this is the uh, the other things that HK provided uh, for me to do a video on. So again, thank you to HK for doing that. Uh, I wanted to go over their two tank grip options. So they just came out. This is a newer vise. It's to uh, protect the whole tank. And this vise grip has actually been out for a little while. So um, I can actually tell that they already made a difference from originally what I had seen with the vise. So that's already a good move. Uh, but I want to go over both of them, and I am going to be doing a giveaway for both of these. So uh, make sure that you stay tuned so that way you know how to enter. Let's, uh, let's start off with the original Vice. So with the original Vice, uh, and again, like I said, they, they made some changes, which I'm glad to see that they had done that. Um, this is just going to be the grip for the back end of the tank here. So sorry about the tape residue that I have on here, but... Uh, this is just going to be uh, for the grip on the back, so that way you don't have your tank slipping and sliding all over the place. Some people prefer to have this one, which is why HK is providing it there uh, as a product for you to uh, to purchase. So um, the only downside with these is that it's not protecting the front end of your tank. It's not going to protect this side here. Now. If that doesn't bother you, then this is gonna work perfect. But I wanted to go over the uh, the actual product itself. So first things first, uh, the change that I meant was when they originally came out with this, the vise was very uh, stiff. So I'm actually really glad that it's, it's a lot more flexible than what it was before. Um, and also, uh, it still has a good grip on the back. So the, uh, the material on the back there is all textured. So that way uh, it's not gonna be sliding around um, around on your shoulder. So to actually put this onto your tank, so I apologize, but I am gonna have to rip this off. So if you win, I apologize that it's, I'll, I'll still put the tag in there, but uh, I do have to take this off so that way I can show you how to put this all on <laughs> together here. Okay, so with the uh, the vice grip here, um, so I don't have it exactly centered, but uh, so forgive me for that one, but um, Unlike other tank grips where you want to flip it inside out and roll it on, the vice grip actually works best just to slide it right on. It's going to make it easier uh, to do that if you try to flip it inside out. It actually makes it more difficult. Uh, but something I'm pleasantly surprised with is uh, how, how well it stays on. It's something that it's not going to come off very easily. You're going to have to kind of peel it off, which is a good thing because you don't want to dive and lose your tank grip. Uh, what I like too is it's not overly... Uh, aggressive with the grip if that makes sense you don't want it to be something that's like ripping your jersey or uh, like I live in Florida during the summertime this is usually how I play I'm in a, a tank top usually with my elbow pads or whatever just because it's so hot but I don't want it to be like ripping up my shoulder and I think this is still gonna give good grip uh, and still allow me to have control over my gun so that's that's a good thing um, so what's cool to see is that, like I said, from the original vice grip, it was definitely a lot more stiff. And I think that the changes that they made, and I didn't even realize that they made these changes, really makes this a, a great grip. It's something that uh, you can kind of get more aggressive with the logo, so it kind of helps you stand out a little bit. Um, but also, it, it it's doing its job. It's something that it's not going to be coming off very easily. It's going to uh, give you that grip that you want. and. Um, yeah, I, I'm pleasantly surprised with this. It's a, a, a very well-made uh, tank grip. Okay, so let's get this one off and uh, let's talk about the other vice grip. So the new vice grip that uh, HK came out with is a full cover tank, tank grip. Now it's a very interesting design. It's a two-piece design. So let me just get these two pieces out. So it's a two-piece design. Uh, you can kind of see that they would sort of go together. Uh, they kind of have like a jigsaw looking uh, shape to them. Um, but it's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's made to protect your whole tank. You're still going to have a little bit of a section that it shows a little bit, but that's going to help with uh, being able to kind of peel back easily to show, just in case you need to show, is my tank in hydro? Um, you know, is it still allowable at tournaments? Because you don't want to get uh, a penalty for that uh, over something very simple. Um, so let's, uh, let's just put it on the, the tank and see how it fits. So this first section you put over the, uh, the reg and it kind of just slides on there. Pull that back. And the next one, just kind of same thing, kind of slides on. And like I had said before, I, I don't know that I would recommend, uh, flipping this inside out. It might work a little bit better with this one. Uh, 
but yeah, I'm actually, again, I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised with this. When I first saw this, I'll be honest, uh, feeling the inside of the, uh, the tank grip itself, I was like, I don't know how well this is going to work. Um, but I'm pleasantly surprised with this. I, what I like is that I, I don't think I'm going to be able to like, even if it does kind of roll back like that a little bit, I mean, it, it flips right back. So I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised with this. Uh, this is actually a very well-made tank grip. So what's cool with this is it actually fits a 48, a 68, and an 80 uh, in like the normal tank sizes. And then this is an SL77, so, uh, and it fits fine on there. I mean, it's, if you do have any sections where you're like, oh, it feels like it's a little bit loose, if you pull a little bit, it kind of flattens it out. So like I was having that earlier where I thought there was kind of like bubbles or whatever, extra space in the back end here. And I just pulled a little bit more and it tightened it up. So overall though, I mean, I, this isn't coming off. Like that's not going to come off easily. If you take a dive, it's not going to be something that, uh, is, is going to be just flying off, which is really cool. Cause again, when I first saw this, I didn't think it was going to work well. I'll be honest. I was kind of wondering how this was all going to work, but they put some cool designs into it. Um, so the grip on the back is similar to the, uh, the vice grip. So you can see that they both have that kind of textured design. So it's, again, it's not going to be too aggressive that it hurts like, or it rips your Jersey. Uh, but it's still going to have enough grip that it's going to be, um, uh, helping you to, to keep your gun steady. Um, they do have a bunch of cool designs. Um, so shout out, actually, I will say this. I know talking with the, uh, the representative from, I won't mention your name, uh, from HK that, uh, was talking with me about doing these. And, uh, <laughs> so he went to grab a, a Houston heat one and I was like, well, I can't support them. They're my, my competition, but actually I, I do want to give a shout out to Ronnie. Uh, Ronnie Dizon's a buddy of mine on Houston heat. So congratulations on winning cup. Uh, so I guess I will give you a shout out for that one, but yeah. So overall, I mean, I, I'm, again, I'm pleasantly surprised with this. It's not something that I thought was gonna be a very good product. I'll, again, I'll just be very honest with you. But it's cool to see that the changes that the, uh, the guys at HK made for the vice grip, the original one, kind of made its way over to this and they kind of learned from mistakes they made before, which is great. I mean, that's, that's a sign of a, a good company that they look at how can we improve something that we've already done and there's always room for improvement. If you think that your product is perfect, you probably shouldn't be in that industry because there is always something better that you can do. So uh, that being said, how can I win this, Greg? Uh, so, and no, it's not my tank. Don't take my tank. <laughs> So the way that you can enter to win the vice grips is I want you to put down in the comments down below, uh, which is the one that you want. Give me your first and second choice. I'm going to be doing the drawing whenever I have the date around here somewhere. Uh, so be sure to uh, get that comment in before the drawing time. So that way you will be entered and I'll be contacting the, uh, the winner directly. So be sure to follow the instructions on the screen and that way you'll be entered into the uh, the contest. So good luck to you guys. Thank you again to HK for providing these products. It's really cool that you guys have done that. Um, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next video, but as always remember, watch, learn, win. Thanks.